The most common feature in Victorian photography collections is a portrait photograph. And there are many clues that can help you identify when and where these images were taken. For example, the hairstyles and the clothing that people are wearing, the way they are posing, the backgrounds, um, painted backgrounds on the photographs, as well as the cards they are mounted on or the frames they are in. And there's information in your reading list that will help you direct towards other resources that you can use to identify Carta Visites. Victorian photography heavily refers to the earlier tradition of portrait painting. The backgrounds, painted backgrounds used in photographs and the way people posed on them often referred to the 18th century paintings of nobility. For example, um, posing with a book or a bookcase refers to literacy and that was very important to the Victorians, especially prior to the 1880s when um, compulsory education had not been introduced and not everybody could read. Backdrops depicting views through the window onto gardens or countryside also imitate aristocracy, namely their visual claim to land ownership. Self-image was very important to Victorians. Good photographers chose the poses and props that best suited their clients' social standing and figure. However, it was sometimes also possible to borrow a better set of clothes from the photographer's studio in order to appear more affluent.